Hi, in this video we will look at how to generate normal distribution proportions uh, with calculators. Uh, commonly, this kind of table can be used to uh, generate those proportions, but sometimes uh, you may not have this table. So if you have your calculator, you can generate the proportions uh, with ease. For instance, we may want to know the proportion of scores between the mean and 2.45 standard deviations below the mean. And to do that, we can check the table. Uh, here, we will have a value of uh, 0 0.4929, which is approximate, which is 49.3. Uh, percent of all the uh, values in the distribution okay but it's possible that we use a calculator to determine that and if you use uh, the FX 991 MS uh, calculator it's easy to get uh, that proportion but first you need to set up that calculator and to set up the calculator you need uh, to press mode twice if you press it the first time this is what you see if you press the second time you see this uh, then you'll select one which represents standard deviation select one and then uh, once you do that it, the calculator will display sd at the top and that way your calculator is set up and ready for use so to determine that proportion first you need to press shift and then you press three which represents distribution because we are looking for distributions if we do that the calculator displays this and then we're interested in q so we'll press uh we'll press two if we press two uh then we can put in the Z score. So if you press to Q shows and it opens a bracket and then you can type in the bracket 2.45. Uh, that gives you, if you press equal, the equal sign, it gives you this value here. But if you look at this, you'll see that it is exactly the same thing as the value you would get here. This is 0 0.4929. Okay. Let us assume that we want to know the proportion between the mean and 1.25 standard deviations. You do the, you repeat that uh, process. Press uh, shift, press uh, three, which is distribution, and then press Q. If you press, that is two. Uh, then you can type 1.25 in the bracket. It will give you this value. If you check 1.25 here, it gives you 0 0.3944 and 0 0.39435 is approximately 0 0.3944. So if you use the FX991ES Plus, uh, it's the, the process is very similar first. You need to set up that uh, calculator and to do that press mode if you press mode you will see uh, three statistics so you can select that and then select one for VAR and then once you do that the computer displays this uh, and then you can press AC if you press AC the computer will uh, display at the top V uh, uh, ST80 which is statistics it tells us that the uh, that uh, it's been set up okay so to now generate the the um, the proportion of the distribution that we're interested in we will press uh, the shift button and after pressing the shifts uh, button we can press one first shift then one and then because if you press shift you will see um you'll, you'll okay so you see st80 here representing one so if you press shift and one 
it gives you this and then you can now select five which is for distribution uh, if you do that you will see one two three four press two which is uh, kill and then you can now type in your z score after q so if you type in 2.45 and close the brackets and press equal sign it gives you 0 0.49286 which is exactly the same thing as what we have here 0 0.4929 so that's how we use the calculator to generate those distributions and i hope this has been helpful all the best